Hello and welcome to this 12 part mini series on the triangle. In this series, we're gonna venture through the history, parts, techniques, styles, and everything about the triangle. This is gonna be a, quite a mental and physical and metaphysical journey. And I hope you decide to come along with me and explore the triangle. So first off, um, when you pick it up, you're gonna see three corners. This is called the right corner. Um, this is the top corner. This is called the obtuse corner. So you just gotta remember that. Right in here, this is called the jingle zone. And um, that's not really used in a lot of European pieces, but more Eastern cultures tend to um, utilize this part of the triangle. A lot of people refer to this as the stick, but um, the correct term is the jabber and produces a noise like so. See, you wanna you wanna let it ring like that. You don't wanna muffle the noise at all. Make sure that you have a good acoustic environment for your triangulating. Oh, and then also don't wanna forget about um, the noose string that connects the uh, jabber to the lower body. And also you have your tuck nut inside here. This is important. To, if you're hanging up your triangle, you want to hang it by the tuck nut, like so. Um, oh, and then, there are, many people think there are three sides, but there's actually four sides, because this side is separated. So this one is called the first side, um, second side, third side, and this is called the oblong side right here. That was the parts of the triangle. Um, hope you learned something. And tune in next time for the history of the triangle.